The event started off with a song that filled the small gym, as residents observed something only seen or heard on television or over the radio, a real live Muslim call to prayer. For people like Lethbridge College criminal justice student Stone Leclerc, this was an opportunity to be a part of something mostly practiced behind closed doors. From the mass media on Facebook and everything, you do not get this out there. And if you do, it's very minimal. And I think the other community should definitely try their best to work in more events like this. The Lethbridge Senior Citizens Organization was filled to capacity where tables of authentic Muslim food or halal were being served, pamphlets of information were available and women were given the chance to try on a hijab and have henna painted on their hands. Those in attendance witnessed a presentation on the definition and beliefs of Islam which means submission to Allah, their God's name. Discussing the origins of Islam Followed by Omar Sebidar, an imam or spiritual leader, traveled across the country to dispel fear of the unknown, in this case, Islam. Understanding, uh, greater understanding, greater connections, and as a result we eliminate the fear that we have the unknown. Local imam Aslan Piperwala was pleased with the outcome of the event, a first of its kind in Lutbridge. So, seeing the amount of people that have showed up for this event, it really shows that uh, the people of Lethbridge, um, they support diversity and uh, they want to educate themselves with regards to the diversity itself. And